Vlad and Mickey almost died in a car crash, so make sure to keep on watching until the end to see their crazy crash. This is seven YouTubers who almost died in car crashes. Coming in straight at number seven, we have Jack Doherty, and during one of his live streams, he was driving his brand new Lamborghini, but it was raining heavily and he basically couldn't see the road, and it ended terribly because he lost control of the vehicle and crashed. Guys, you definitely don't want to miss this, so let's get right into it. Airbnb or something on the water until my until we move into that new crib. So we can keep the boats and shit. His live stream briefly cut off, but in the next clip you'll see the aftermath of this crash and it's crazy. So let's get back to it. Help! Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Help! I'm shooting the window, watch out, I'm shooting no, the window. No, don't do it, don't do that. Why? Where's your phone? Breathe. I'm shooting the window. Ugh, don't do it. Like and subscribe or this spider will be in your bed while you're trying to sleep. Jack and his friends survived without any injuries. But up next to number six, we have a clip from Cyrus who hit a deer. He was driving home when a deer just jumped in front of the road out of nowhere and Cyrus couldn't avoid hitting it. It was a really sad clip because he's so upset that he hurt the deer, but he's also grateful that he didn't get injured. So let's check it out. Good vibes, life's not always perfect. Come back stronger, things happen, but most important thing is that you're safe so let's just go take a look at these damages before the tow truck gets here this is crazy guys it just happened here at night i'll show you where it happened Yo, let's take a look at this car oh my gosh the whole front went up here it happened right back there look i can't even open the door it's blocked from opening the door it's crazy look this whole part right here is coming off that's probably why i can't open the door i'm just so grateful that Oh man, everyone behind me was safe. You can still see the hair from the deer. Oh my gosh, look at that. What I don't understand is how the deer just I don't know, just ran across the whole freeway, I guess. Luckily, Cyrus didn't get injured. Now, in number five, we have Tanny Bungard. And in this clip, he shows the aftermath of crashing his Audi R8. You can hear how nervous he is because he had just survived this insane crash. And he was also with his friends, who just like Tanner, didn't get injured. So it's a miracle that both of them survived without any injuries. Let's roll the clip. So, uh, yeah, here is the iPhone footage from that day. Phone, oh my God. Are you kidding me, bro? God. First of all, I'm sorry to you. Oh my God, we uh, we took all, we took out the fence. Yes, we did. Yeah. Yeah. We'll let him know. Hey, is all up in here, dude? Look at that path. No way. We literally flew off the road. Thank God this car does not like to flip. Cause look at how. As you just saw, the car is totaled. But in the next clip, he explains how he crashed the car. That is, and we just. Parts of my car all over the place, the wrap everywhere. No way. I'm like, I'm too like in shock and like scared for you no, I'm good. to like to be mad right now. The sun is setting right there, and as you can see around that corner, it was so bright I couldn't see anything. I was going decently fast, but I've done this a million times. This road is the one I go down all the time. I downshifted, couldn't see, and just went off the road, slammed on the brakes continued to just go through here, not slowing down whatsoever. We hit this at about 40. His car was completely wrecked. Now in number four, we have a clip from one stock F30, who's an amateur racer, and he shares his racing videos on YouTube. But one day he had a terrible accident on the track where he reached the top speed of 170 miles per hour before crashing. Fortunately, he did survive, but it's one of the craziest crashes caught on camera, so let's check it out. clip you'll see this epic slow motion clip from which the crash looks even crazier
might have been the craziest car crash caught on camera. Anyways, now at number three, we have a clip from Danny Bionic, and he talks about how one night he crashed his brand new McLaren. So basically, the road was really slippery, and Danny lost control of his vehicle and crashed it under the bridge. But luckily, he didn't get hurt, so let's get right to it. Oils from the road literally rise up to the surface, so you have water and oil that aren't mixed together. Oil is super, like, much more slippery, and then, yeah, you're basically driving on ice, bro. You're just driving on ice. No matter, you know, I tried counter steer, but how can you counter steer when, like, one second you're here, and then the next second you're getting, whoa. You know, I'm literally facing the wall. So I tried In the next clip, he shows the aftermath of the crash. The thing I did was just get out of there myself since the car was literally on the left lane on the highway. And I tried to call police, but the thought of someone else potentially hitting the car and them getting hurt just freaked me out. So whether it was dumb or not, I decided to go back into the car once I thought I had enough time and like didn't see cars coming to try and turn it back on. Because first, before we get to see how Vlad and Nikki got into a car crash, let's take a look at clip number two from Matt Armstrong, who crashed his Lamborghini. It wasn't just a Lamborghini for him because it was his first that he modified by installing twin turbos and other modifications, making it a real beast. But it all took a turn for the worse when one evening he crashed it into a tree. So let's roll the clip. I, I won't. I'm glad I'm not hurt. I didn't hurt anybody else. I knew, I knew it was death in the wet. I knew it was death, but it literally just snapped. Yeah, I'm good. Just on the phone too, please. What have you done, Matt? A uh, slight accident. So now the reality's setting in on what's just happened to the Gordo. Some of the residents have come out of the houses to see if I was okay, and somehow I've been untouched. But the car, on the other hand, looks a complete mess. I was on the phone to the police to see what was the next. Finally, at number one, we have Vlad and Nikki. And for his birthday, Nikki bought a brand new car. But as you can guess, he doesn't know how to drive. And because of that, he ended up getting into a huge accident. But things only got worse for him as time went on. So make sure to keep on watching until the end. In the next clip, Nikki gets into another crash. 